So here's a couple more circuits uh, I built in the various analog classes I've had. Um, th this is a, a siren uh, that uses um, two 555 uh, oscillators and then um, they interfere with each other to create um, some interesting signals. So I can Very interesting. Also mildly annoying sometimes, <laughs> the sounds that come out of it. Um, but really great circuit and it, uh, it inspired me to do the, uh, the 555 oscillator that I used um, for the, uh, some of the custom circuits that, that I'm experimenting now uh, for some of my own research. Um, and then here is um, an amplifier. This is a little audio amplifier circuit. Uh, I believe it's a push-pull. Uh, we've got these two transistors here, um, and again, I think uh, one of my professors designed this, and then this we built, it was just a kit, um, but we, we really went through and studied uh, radio um, frequency modulation and amplitude modulation, bandwidth, I mean, how an LC circuit, an LC tank, um, can you know select for carry you know different carrier frequencies and how the the information uh, signal is is then filtered out of the carrier um, wave uh, and you know the difference between Y and AM antenna has all these windings uh, which relates to um, the the frequency of the carrier um, versus FM which has a shorter antenna um, yeah so and this still works after years of lying around. It's it's the potentometer in here is a little shoddy. So yeah. But uh yeah it was really uh really a great demonstration of um how uh, analog waves can be um, worked with.